how could that be effective for you? So in terms of what happens once we're done here tonight, um, our plan is to take what we've been hearing, and this is one of nine community meetings we're holding. So last week we were on Haida Gwaii in Skidget and Massif. Uh, we were in Prince Rupert in Kitimat. And this week we were in Campbell River last night. We're here tonight and we'll be in um, Shearwater and Kalakula for the remainder of the week. Finishing with a meeting in Vancouver next week. So once we finish that round of meetings, and people have submitted comments to us online or in writing or by phone outside of these meetings. We'll sort of be revising that engagement strategy and then beginning to implement different pieces of it. So one of the, the first things that we plan to do is actually convene that integrated oceans advisory group so that we have a group that comes together and can start providing input and start working on the actual planning process. So our intention here is to have a two-year timeline for that planning process, and the clock on that starts ticking once we convene that advisory committee. That's our intention. So that's what will happen once we're out of this meeting. And in, or in order for us to actually have an advisory committee in place, what that's going to mean is we're going to need to be coming back to communities like this one, back to sectors and to different interest groups, and asking how do we identify participants play a role on that committee. What does that look like for different communities? What does it look like for different sectors? And that's again a topic of conversation that we'll be inviting your thoughts on after this presentation. So in addition to your ability to provide us feedback here tonight, uh, you can submit us comments in writing, of course, or you can submit them <coughs> by email. Um, you can even call me if you, um, if you want to speak further. Uh, the deadline for these comments is April the 16th, and that's when we're going to begin sort of gathering what we've heard and advising about that engagement strategy to start, to start implementing the planning process. So that's it. Um, I guess there's a bit of time for some general questions. I think our intention is to go into the small group discussions. Yeah, I think actually what I'd like to suggest is some of you uh, need to leave um, early. Um, let's take a quick break. You can grab a cup of coffee uh, and, and something to eat if you like. And then we'll come back and given the numbers, I think we can just have two tables and reps from the steering committee and the planning office will sit with you to walk through the questions that they have and any other questions that you have. And that way it could be a more kind of interactive uh, discussion rather than just kind of this question and answer thing. Okay? So coffee's there. Grab a cookie, I'll ring the bell in like five minutes and we'll be back at these tables, okay?